Hello everyone, my name is Drupa and welcome back to a, another video. Today I'm going to show you guys how to install some more custom cubicle mods into your guys' 5M server. This is a really, really great mod. So hit the link down in the description below. That means goes right here to the civilian job mega pack by this guy right here, Angelic XS. Really, really, really awesome mod. It is free and also there are no requirements beside the basic QB core mods. So it's really neat and super simple to install with a bunch of awesome jobs, which otherwise would probably be a pretty expensive mod. So all you guys are going to want to do, hit the link down in the description below. That ring goes right here. Go down to this little part right here where it says GitHub link and just click the little hyperlink. Go to code and then download zip. Once you guys have downloaded that, open it on up. And you guys should be able to see inside of here is going to be all of your standard Cubicore script files. So that's how we know that this folder right here is going to be the folder we give our 5M server. So the first steps to install this into our 5M server is going to be opening our 5M server directory. So mine is right here in my servers and then Cubicore. That's going to be my Cubicore 5M server. Then navigate into your TX data folder, Cubicore framework and resources. Now, if you guys haven't got a Cubicore framework server set up yet, then be sure to watch my video on setting up a Cubicore server first and then come back to this video later on. But if you already have, then I'm going to show you guys something that is really awesome, very simple and makes your life 10 times easier. Now, you guys can see I have a bunch of folders in here and you guys will notice they all have brackets at the beginning and the end. That's because I have organized my 5M server in a nice and neat way that makes my life 10 times easier. Now brackets at the beginning and the end will turn that folder into something called a subcategory folder. So everything input inside of this folder will be insured automatically and you only need to insure that folder itself. No more insuring every folder, folder by folder, every single time you add a mod having to insure, you can just insure this one folder once and then that is it. So if you guys haven't done this yet, right click, make a new folder and call it maybe QB additional like me or maybe QB extra or extra QB core mods, literally anything you want and just make sure you put the brackets at the beginning and the end. When just briefly, I wanted to tell you guys about my new website, hcnetwork.1, which actually sets up a 5M server for you. If you guys cannot be bothered to deal with all the management and having to add in mods and things like that, you can literally just check out my website down in the description below, www.htnetwork.1, and you can set up a 5M server in literally just a couple of seconds using the included auto installer, and it will have already over 120 plus mods. That's custom vehicles, custom maps, custom menus, literally everything you guys can need, and you literally did not have to do anything. So check that out down in the description below, www.htnetwork.1. Let's go to done that, open it on up, and all you need to do, grab this folder right here and drag and drop it in like so. Very, very simply from here, all you guys are gonna to wanna to do is we're gonna delete this main and little hyphen part right here. Just delete that like so, and just like that, we are done. Now, if we open that on up, you guys will see a config.lua. Now inside of here, if we open it with notepad, is going to be all the configurations don't mess with any of this top part right here you really don't need to but from below here you can if you want to such as your blip preferences your rewards items general configs you can check this out and edit it as you guys see fit but from here if you guys have made some changes just make sure you close it and save also and then from here we're going to go back to our resources folder and now if you added a new subcategory folder like i showed you guys just a second ago Make sure you copy the name of that folder, go back to the Cubicore framework folder, open your server.cfg on up, and we'll just insure this subcategory. So type insure, and then paste the name of that subcategory folder on in, and then anything placed inside of there will be automatically insured from here on out. And now we have done that, we have installed the mod, we should be good to launch our 5M server. Now for Cubicore servers, we need to make sure our XAMP is started on up first. So just start our XAMP and our Apache and MySQL on up, and then double click our default dot bat to start the server on up. And once you guys are in game, all you need to do is hit pause, go to the map, and you guys can already see all of our new angelic mods already in game. Our bus, lifeguard, loading company, taxi, trash, undersea, and a bunch of other jobs. Really awesome. And all you guys need to do to actually trigger them, say so if you wanted to do the loading company, we'll just set a waypoint. We'll do t slash tpm, which is our cubicle admin teleport command. So take us straight there. We'll spawn in a guy. You use your alt third eye key to interact. Right click and you can request work. 
just like that it's going to ask you to grab the pallet and you guys can start the work it will mark everything on the map give you a vehicle and it's really really well made to be fair to the mod creators so be sure to check him out and give him some love and support if you guys couldn't be bothered with all the setup of a mod like this and you guys would rather just auto install it all in one click then no problem be sure to check out my website hgnetwork.one which has an exclusive auto installer and you can install mods like this in literally just one click super simple super easy and probably a lot easier and a lot more time efficient than videos like these so be sure to check that out down in the description below like comment and subscribe and i'll see all of you guys in the next one cheers and goodbye